As prices continue to rise, 7 News is helping you and your family make ends meet. Many homeowners took on renovation projects throughout the pandemic. Both of our families yes, did. did. After spending so many months cooped up inside. But like many other industries, the cost of home improvement is just on the rise. Lumber up 200% since the pandemic began. The cost of adding a new room, expanding a closet, installing cabinets all up more than 30 percent since 2020. 7 News reporter Natalie Fahmy tells us how you can save money while renovating your home. The new stuff is more expensive. Plywood, you know, everything from glue to nails to paint. Ian McDonald from Reuse Action says the demand for materials keeps going up. He tells me his store has seen a lot of traffic since the pandemic began. I guess there are people out of work. We're starting to do projects they've been holding off for for years. But he says there are ways to save money, like buying used. For example, a new water heater could run you anywhere from $400 to $2,000. But used, this one is being sold for just under $200. Even if they lasted another five years, that's still a savings. Co-owners of AAA Timberline, Jeff Kramer and Ryan Gott, say you can also save money by bundling projects. Have one contractor do multiple projects in your home if possible possible and try doing some stuff by yourself. If you take stuff apart yourself, it may mean you, you're going to get a little dirty. You're going to put some, some sweat equity into your home, but uh, that always, always saves money. Like everything else, the supply chain is holding up materials and making them more expensive. All different types of materials that we deal with. We're constantly getting emails every month or two, another 5% increase, another 7% increase. Some of it's completely unavailable because of supply chain uh, choke points. Gott and Kramer tell me items that used to take four to six weeks to arrive now take three times as long to come in. We plan for the worst and we hope for the best and we, uh, we bought a barn full of stuff. Meantime, if you're looking for some inspiration for your next project, the Buffalo Home Show will be back this and next weekend at the Buffalo Niagara Convention Center. Natalie Fahmy, 7 News, Buffalo.